Welcome back to Daily Squat Gaming. Today we are in Farming Simulator 2022. <clears throat> maybe one day I'll just call it FS22. Or better yet, maybe I don't have to tell you what game we're in anyways because you probably already know that. Uh, I, I, I try my hardest, really. I do. Uh, so, you guys are probably all dying to figure out what or how many bales we had. And we had harvested... 427 so unfortunately I'm recording this before I've uh, uploaded the previous episode so yeah I will uh, give a congratulations to the closest person without going over yep it's it's price is right rules and uh, yeah you you win a uh, a little thumbs up and a heart emoji and <laughs> and yeah sadly that's that's all I can give away so but anyways Let's get this uh, taken care of and basically what I want to do and what I will be doing is I will be getting rid of that uh, auto loading, auto bail loader and we will be taking all this hay. All, I, ha I haven't even done the math of how many bales we have but um, actually hold on one second. Let me do the math real quick just so that I can, that I can say it. Alright, I ran the calculation and we have 280 bales, so hopefully I counted correctly. But we have 7 high, 5 wide, and 8 long. Yes, 8 long. I don't know why. <laughs> it looks like I only have 7 long, but it's 8 long. So, uh, we have 280 bales of hay. And because we have this auto loader, which I do have to look at the controls real quick, because some of these operate differently than what you would expect so um man i would love i would love to be able to try to put them in there i'm gonna i'm gonna give it a shot i, I don't know if i'm gonna be able to do it um i also have other things in there so oh shoot uh yeah hold on one second all right, through some magic of editing and um, super strength. <laughs> I don't know why I'm, I'm like hiding the fact that I'm using super strength. I think you guys probably can tell. Uh, it's not like I'm doing a, uh, a whatchamacallit, but uh, let's see if I can. No, that didn't work. Um, stop unloading, operating. Unload bales. Whoa. <laughs> okay, that did not work the way I wanted to. Abort unloading. Alright, let's, uh, yeah, let's operate position. We're gonna let this basically restack itself. Yeah, that's kind of what I was afraid of. Um, how do I get those guys back? Uh, <laughs> okay. We've got some uh, magical floating. There we go. And we're going to grab this one. Now these bales I can actually pick up. Okay, I don't, yeah. Let's see, can we get them all? Oh, somehow I have two extras. Uh, I'm gonna guess that somehow I cloned. All right, so let's turn on loading, pos or uh, yeah. It, there's something to do with, with that. See, now I can pick. Oh, but I can't set it back in. That's that's highway robbery right there. Um, bummer. I was hoping. Yeah, I have side to side and up and down. I don't have front or back. Ooh, I have rotate. I do have front and back. Yes. And that will. Does that glitch through? 
Yeah, that had to glitch through. All right, we're going to eyeball this. We're going to set this down. Oh, there we go. Gotta get it as close as possible to the ground and unload the bales there. No, unload the bales here. What? Oh, oh. Okay, so that's glitching. That's not. Okay, so now I should be able to unload bales. Okay, you know what? Good enough. Good enough. Uh, let's stop unloading. Let's go to operating position. So I can just pick these up. Which is uh, fan freaking tastic. Uh, because I can do this. And we can, uh, we can actually kind of store these in here anyways. Oh, really? I can't get close enough? Maybe I did. Oh, that's an awesome powers moment. That's another one that I had. Alright, so the good news is... We can just, uh... Yeah, we'll get these offloaded. Unload. Now I can move them basically wherever I want. Except for the twisting motion for some reason. Get them really close to the ground before you let them go. How did I go side by side last time? I twisted it left to right. Oh. Alright, well you know what? That works too. We're going to unload here. Perfect. Stop unloading. Alright, so the bales aren't perfect and I've wasted a lot of time doing this, but I'm going to go into operation mode. We're going to try to pick up most of these. There we go. Ooh. I just, I want it to stop after this next row. No, oh, you stupid. Why would you take that? Okay, whatever. You know what? Good enough. <laughs> it's fine. I'm being picky. Uh, let's go ahead and, uh, yeah, I almost need a, a drive through for my hay. Uh, cause backing this trailer up is horrible. Because it's a dolly trailer and dolly trailers are absolute garbage when it comes to backing up. I don't, I don't even know how I'm going to do this. Let's go into the field. Let's pick up the rest of them. We're just going to have to wing them in somewhere. Um, I, I'm really disappointed that this trailer is a dolly. Kind of wish they had a way to lock the dolly. Because those, those have to exist. you got to be able to lock your dolly and then... Um... Yeah, and then you don't have to worry about... The dolly working when you're trying to back up. Like, that just... It makes way too much sense for it not to be true. If you know what I mean. Like, a lot of times I have a lot of dumb ideas, but most of the time I have good ones, and that seems like it would be a really good idea to have on a dolly trailer. Because I, I don't know anyone that can actually back one up. I mean, I can back one up, but it wouldn't be very nice. It wouldn't be very clean. But yeah, so let's... We could probably grab... We probably won't get them all, which is unfortunate, but maybe. Maybe we'll get lucky. I am doing a lot of... yeah, I should just go in one straight line. 
And uh, yeah, I think I'm going to pick up all these hay bales and then we are going to advance to... We're going to advance to June and we're going to sell what we have on the trailer. Um, obviously what's at the sheep enclosure is staying with the sheep. And then we'll have some in the barn for backup just in case. Um, but yeah, we're going to... Um, this year we've we've missed the harvest unfortunately or no not the harvest the planting season um so everything has to be in the ground by this month and we have we have no cultivator we have no way to plant anything we we've got nothing so uh what's gonna end up happening is that um i'm gonna jump out real quick because if i cut open these bales i can pick them all up <laughs> come on there we go and then I can, now I can pick them all up. There we go. Boom. I wish the rest of the field was that easy. But you know what? This makes it uh, much more, uh, in my eyes, viewable. Like, to watch me have to pick up 427 odd bales with a auto, or with a, the auto baler pickup. I don't even know what to call it thing. Uh, I call it something different every time, but to pick it up with that thing, 14 bales at a time, I would have been here till the end of the year. Like I, I would have had to do 30 month days and do one X time. <laughs> and I still think I probably would, wouldn't have enough time to, to do it all. Um, are we getting close now? All right. Hopefully fingers crossed we can pick up the rest of these. I think we only have one more row though. This should be the last of what we can pick up. But hopefully, fingers crossed. We should have enough. We should. But yeah, as I was saying, we uh, we missed the planning season, so we are just going to we're gonna have to suffer by doing hay. Uh, this, this year, like we, we have just these two fields, I believe. Do we have a third field? I don't know why. No, we don't. Okay. For some reason I was thinking we owned field three. Um, but you know, that's, that's just me. Uh, you can see my awkward cutting. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I did cut part of the field and then cut it on a different day, so... Uh, but yeah, we're gonna advance, we're gonna see how much hay we have, how many sheep we'll have at the end of... Well, at the beginning of June. And, uh, yeah, we're going to, uh, sell everything on this trailer. I don't believe we need to keep any of it. We've got a large amount of hay there. Like, way too much hay. Like, way too much hay. And it's sticking out. How do I? Oh, I turned. Okay, never mind. I thought I still had super strength on. <laughs> oh, wow. All right, so we're done picking up the hay. We can, uh, yeah, we can go ahead and advance to the next day. Which now that I put this in. I can sleep until, I'm going to say 7. Yeah, we're going to sleep till 7. Hay was $92 per thousand liters. So hopefully we, uh, we increased the price a little bit. We did, uh, yeah, we did lose $2,700. And it looks like they need bales, so this might be uh, a good thing. Uh, what I should have done, too, is I wasn't thinking, but you know what? We've got a quarter tank of battery left, or quarter battery left, so we should be okay there. Uh, where is... Uh, let's go... No, I did have it in the right one. <laughs> let's see. Where is this? Oh, it went down a dollar, but it's showing that it's going up. Whatever. Uh, so we've got that tagged. We're... Is it? Oh, it's way over there. Alright, 
So let's look at the map. It is oh way back there. So we gotta go down past the store, up the road to the left. Okay. I think I know where that is. I think I know, I think I know, I think I know. Uh let's go ahead and before I forget. Uh where is it? There it is. That's weird, it's not letting me untag it. Oh, that's why. Dummy. There we go. Now I can untag it. <laughs> Alright, so let's get, uh... Let's get this hay over there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and, and just say... Screw it. We're gonna, we're gonna do the drive. Um... But I will put it on a... Time lapse. Let's do it that way, instead of cutting it out completely. Throw it on the side plants, and we'll see you when we're over there. Alright, so hopefully I can uh, unload these. Maybe. Oh, uh, yeah, that, that didn't really go to plan. <laughs> uh, let's see if we can just get the trailer and the, the trigger completely. Ooh, that's going to be tight. All right, it was charging me. All right, we might have to cut all that. So there is something going on with that gate. For some reason, that's twice now that I've uh, <laughs> gotten stuck on it. I thought maybe the first time I did it, I hit the pole or the gate itself, but I think it's the uh, the cattle gate that is uh, causing me issues for some reason. Uh, but that's okay. We'll. Uh, We'll just cut it out if it ever happens again. Um, so we've got this field here. It is... It is ready for harvest. It's not very tall though. And maybe maybe we'll wait one more month. Uh, we, we probably will start advancing pretty quick now. Let's keep an eye on the lambs. Or the sheep. Let's see where they're at. Uh, we've got plenty of food still. That's good. Let's go ahead and get these two bales into the trigger. Maybe. There we go. Alright, so they're good there. We have uh, 32 sheep now. So, let's uh, see what that looks like on paper. Uh, are they breeding? I don't think they're breeding yet. Hmm. Better yet. What is the capacity of this uh, barn? Uh, it does not say. Oh, 65. Okay, good. So we're, we're still at 32. We're just going to let them go. Um, I do want to get a ram, though. Uh, we do not have a ram yet. What ram do I want? What one makes the most sense? Goats? I'm not worried about goats. We're not going to get goats yet. Maybe if we get another... Do I want an all-black mountain ram? A Welsh ram? I mean, I could basically start off with a calf. Uh, or do I want to go with a... Steinschaft. I totally pronounced that wrong, I know. Baham. Benta. I don't even know how to pronounce these words, like... 
Bethlehem. Bethlehem? It's not Bethlehem. Uh, anyways, you know what? Because, uh, because that's all I got. I'm going to go with the, uh, I'm going to save some money and get a male ram. Just get one. We're going to throw it in there. And I know you probably wouldn't do this in real life. But I kind of want to get that one too. So let's, uh, oh, let's get that one as a young ram. I think, I think it might be okay. Um, I know you usually don't want a lot of rams. Let's see if we can find them. Where are you? You're in all these sheets. So you're the little guy. You're going to have so much fun when you grow up. Where's the other one? He's around here somewhere. Oh, there he is. He's just like, I'm young, I'm dumb, and I'm ready to uh, eat some hay. Yeah, anyways. <laughs> Let's go ahead and uh, get out of get out of the sheep enclosure and let's uh, yeah let's go ahead and skip to the next month. There's not really anything we can do except for when we start to mow again. Um, you know what I do want to do? We're we're definitely down to about a quarter battery. So I'm gonna plug this in and see how long it takes to uh, to charge it up. Is that all I gotta do is get within range? Is that how that works? I have I have no clue how this works, so I I'm guessing that I am in range, so it's technically plugged in. Uh, let's see if there's any controls or anything that pop up. Uh no. Alright, well we're gonna see if that charges it. Oh, uh, like I said, we are on a quarter. My guess is it's going to take a while to charge, so it's you're not going to see it moving. So let's go ahead and skip uh, all the way to July. We're going to go mid-summer. Actually, it's still relatively early summer in July. Uh, but let's go ahead and go ahead and sleep. We're going to wake up. We're going to have grass to cut again. I know. I'm sorry. I apologize. We're going to try to save up enough money to... Uh, to really get things rolling. Um, I have to start thinking, so I do want to... I do want to wait. And I have to, like I said, think. So this is perfectly good to cut. Great, great amount of length on it. Beautiful field. Uh, we still have... Oh, we still have baby lambs. And then we have sheep. Are they lambs or sheep? Uh, sheep are grown. Lambs are... Yeah, I don't know. Anyways, they're male lambs. Let's just call them that, what they are. Uh, we shouldn't have any more... No, so sh we should still be at 34. If I could count. And if we check at the animals... Uh, we are at 60%. So they are getting oh so close to being able to breed. Now, I don't know if they need the males to breed. Um, it just says health, so I think lucky for the males, they can just, um, yeah, they basically reproduce out of the womb, I guess. I don't know. Um, although one month seems a little young still, but hopefully, hopefully they'll become of age. Anyways, um, I guess let's check on the tractor. Uh, no, it did, doesn't look like it charged at all. That's not good. Um, I'm not sure how the charging mechanism works. Does, does it just need more time? We literally skipped 12 hours and... No charging. I walk up to it. All right, you know what? I'm going to just assume. Normally there's... Oh, there we go. You have to push down on uh, L1. 
or the uh, the left joystick there. All right. Well, you know what? It takes six minutes and fourteen seconds of real time to charge. So yeah, we will uh, we'll let that charge. Let's go check out our field over here. Possibly, maybe, sort of. This is obviously not growing. Nothing's really going on here. This is the uh, cow enclosure. And we've got two different stages of growth here, so this field will definitely wait till uh, I think August to, to harvest. Now we need to we need to rent basically is what we need to do uh, come this spring or sorry scratch that fall because we will be putting in a winter crop. Uh, so we will be putting in probably wheat. Uh, because wheat and yeah, wheat is used. Wait, is wheat used for? Oh my god, I want to get chickens. We don't have chickens, um, but we can get ducks too. Uh, do 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 do. Does it tell me? It's not going to tell me here, is it? No. So we have to go into this menu. Uh, and it's not going to let me pick there. I should know this. I, I feel kind of dumb for not knowing this. But. Chickens eat. Okay, wheat, barley, and sorghum. That's what it is. I, uh, yeah. So we're definitely going to do wheat. And yeah, we're going to have to rent. Let me out. Let me out. We're definitely going to have to rent the equipment to do our first field, but um, yeah, I, I think I think what I want to do. Uh, first of all, let's go ahead and we are going to sell. No, it's not that one. There we go. We're going to sell this because that is worth a lot of money. No, we're not. You know why? We got to take it back. We got to repair it and paint it, and then we make more money. So, uh, yeah, we're we're we've got a half tank. We're good. So let's go ahead and go get it out of the field. It's it's been sitting there for what two months now. <laughs> In fact, the grass underneath is probably dead. It's so pretty. Look at how interesting this cutting job I did was. But uh, yeah, let's get this hooked up. Let's get it back to the store. Oop. Oh, geez. And uh, yeah, we'll we'll see you over there. All right, so let's get this repaired, fixed and painted and sold. <laughs> uh, do, 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 do. Let's prepare for $60. Boom, that went up more than $60. And let's repaint for 3700 Oh, that's a lot. Uh, we should be around 55 838 oh. 30. What? Where did I get 35 from? 55 838 I can do the math. Okay. 56. So yeah, you can see we do get about an extra $500, which is amazing right now. So let's go ahead and sell this. Boom. We actually have $78,000. Uh, so I brought the, uh, the trail or the, this trailer, geez, the, um, mower to get washed. So luckily they've, uh, done that already. All right. So I just put our tractor on the charger should be done in, uh, about four minutes. So by the time we get back, we will be uh, fully charged. We can pick up this random bale, maybe. There we go. Go ahead and drop it in here for the sheep. And let's check on the sheep before we uh, call it an episode. Uh, so there we have uh, 34 sheep. And uh, two rams. So 32 sheep and two rams. So. Uh, they seem to be doing just fine. If we go into the 
animal menu, you can see that, uh, well, they haven't given birth yet, which isn't surprising. <laughs> and the uh, male rams are still one month old. So they should hit 12 months uh, in the next month, which is where we will be back to... Uh, well, we're going to be back to uh, to cut our field. So if I just go real quick into plate mode, we will uh, be doing that field one more time, turning it into hay. And then this field here. Actually, you know what? I take that back. We're going to do just grass. Um, I could do hay. Uh, in fact, what sizes are... Oh, that's right. I sold our tether. I accidentally sold the tether. Yeah, so we're just going to do grass. Uh, if you take a look at the prices, you've got grass at $70 and hay at $91. So hay is actually coming down. Yeah, we're at the worst time for hay. And, uh, yeah, we were actually just getting better for, uh, for grass. So, but the price difference between the two, uh, is basically nothing. You're talking about $20 per thousand liters. Uh, I'm not going to worry about it. The extra work isn't really worth it. Not to mention we don't have the equipment, so let me just go ahead and uh, shut off flight mode and fall back to Earth. And yeah, so uh, we might even be doing, let's see, uh, where is our wool? Here's our wool. Ooh, uh, we just missed the best time to sell our wool. Alright, looks like wool is going to wait until uh, next April. So we'll have some time. Uh, to wait for then but uh, yeah I'm gonna I'm gonna leave it here today was uh, kind of an odd episode but you know that's all right sometimes you uh, do a lot when you're farming and sometimes you don't do much at all so uh, that's a lie I, I don't I don't think you do much at all any day that you're farming <laughs> if you're farming you're you're working your uh, your butt off so anyways I hope you guys enjoyed the episode and uh, I'm actually going to be posting this one a day after I post the last one. And we're going to try to do two episodes a week, Saturday and Sunday. And uh, try to get this uh, series to catch on. And uh, yeah, anyways, we'll uh, see you in the next episode. And uh, where it will already be August. So um, we'll see you then. Bye for now.